Deep focus. How to not get distracted. The essence of focus. Focus is more than just a mental state. It is a spiritual principle and a practical tool for navigating life's complexities. The concept of focus involves directing one's energy and attention toward a specific goal or purpose. This process is not only crucial for achieving success but also for manifesting our deepest desires. The idea that thoughts shape reality is rooted in various spiritual and philosophical traditions, where focus is seen as the bridge between intention and manifestation. Drawing inspiration from thinkers like Joe Dispenza, who explores neuroplasticity and energy alignment, and Neville Goddard, who emphasizes the power of imagination and the law of assumption, we delve into the mystical and practical aspects of focus. These teachings suggest that by aligning our thoughts and energy, we can reshape our internal and external worlds. The relationship between focus, intention, and the manifestation of reality is a core theme that will be explored throughout this book. At the heart of focus lies the concept of the greater self, a higher aspect of our being that transcends the mundane. This greater self is not confined by the limitations of the ego or daily existence. It is our divine inheritance, a spark of the universal mind. The journey toward discovering this aspect of ourselves involves deep self-discovery and unwavering character development. By aligning with our greater self, we tap into a wellspring of wisdom and power, guiding us toward our true purpose and potential. This process of alignment requires us to move beyond superficial goals and desires, focusing instead on our intrinsic values and the greater good. The greater self is often unveiled through experiences that challenge our perceptions and push us beyond our comfort zones. These moments of transcendence allow us to connect with universal principles, revealing the deeper truths of existence and our place within it. Chapter 1. The Essence of Focus Focus can be defined as the ability to direct one's attention and energy toward a specific objective, excluding all other distractions. It is both a mental discipline and a spiritual practice, essential for achieving personal and professional goals. In spiritual terms, focus is the practice of aligning one's energy with a higher purpose, allowing for the manifestation of desired outcomes. The power of focus lies in its ability to concentrate energy, much like a magnifying glass concentrates sunlight to ignite a flame. In practical terms, focus enhances productivity and efficiency, enabling individuals to accomplish more in less time. It is the foundation of success in any endeavor, as it allows for the sustained effort and dedication required to achieve long-term goals. The importance of focus extends beyond mere achievement, it is also a tool for self-discovery and personal growth. By concentrating our attention, we gain clarity and insight, allowing us to navigate life's challenges with greater ease and understanding. The philosophical and spiritual foundations of focus are deeply intertwined with concepts of consciousness and energy. Joe Dispenza's teachings on neuroplasticity suggest that our brains can be reshaped through focused thought and intentional practice. This idea aligns with the ancient belief that energy follows thought, meaning that where we direct our focus, energy flows. By consciously shaping our thoughts and maintaining a clear focus, we can influence our reality and attract the outcomes we desire. Neville Goddard's teachings on imagination and the law of assumption further illuminate the spiritual aspect of focus. According to Goddard, the mind's creative power lies in its ability to assume the feeling of the wish fulfilled. By focusing on a desired state and embodying it as if it were already achieved, we align our energy with that reality. This practice of focused imagination acts as a powerful tool for manifestation, bridging the gap between the spiritual and material realms. Focus is not merely a cognitive skill but a profound spiritual practice that aligns our inner world with our external reality. It is the key to unlocking our potential, transforming our lives, and realizing our highest aspirations. Through the teachings of spiritual and philosophical masters, 
we can learn to harness the power of focus, creating a life of purpose, fulfillment, and alignment with universal principles. Chapter 2. The Neuroscience of Attention The brain's ability to focus is a complex interplay of various neural mechanisms, primarily involving the prefrontal cortex. This area of the brain is responsible for executive functions, including decision-making, attention control, and goal-setting. The prefrontal cortex works in conjunction with other regions, such as the parietal cortex, which helps in spatial attention, and the anterior cingulate cortex, which monitors conflicting information and focuses the mind on relevant stimuli. Neurotransmitters like dopamine and norepinephrine play crucial roles in regulating attention. Dopamine, often referred to as the reward chemical, enhances focus by creating a sense of pleasure and satisfaction when we concentrate on tasks that align with our goals. Norepinephrine, on the other hand, is involved in arousal and alertness, making it easier to maintain focus, especially under stress or during challenging tasks. Meditation and mindfulness practices have been shown to significantly affect these brain structures and functions. Research indicates that regular meditation can increase the thickness of the prefrontal cortex and improve the connectivity between brain regions involved in attention and emotional regulation. These changes not only enhance focus but also reduce the propensity for mind-wandering and distraction. By training the brain to maintain a state of focused awareness, individuals can develop a more resilient attention span, capable of withstanding the demands of modern life. In our digital age, the omnipresence of technology presents unique challenges to maintaining focus. The constant barrage of notifications, social media updates, and instant access to information can fragment our attention, making it increasingly difficult to concentrate on a single task for extended periods. This phenomenon, often referred to as digital distraction, can lead to a reduction in productivity and a diminished capacity for deep thinking. The convenience of multitasking, encouraged by digital devices, often results in shallow engagement with multiple tasks rather than deep focus on one, impairing overall cognitive performance. Studies have shown that the brain is not naturally adept at multitasking. When we switch between tasks, our brains must repeatedly adjust, resulting in cognitive switching costs. These costs manifest as slower task completion, increased errors, and reduced comprehension. Moreover, frequent exposure to digital stimuli can rewire the brain, fostering a preference for constant novelty and reducing the ability to engage in sustained, focused activity. Understanding these impacts is crucial for developing strategies to mitigate digital distraction and enhance our ability to focus. Meditation and contemplation are powerful practices for cultivating focus and enhancing cognitive abilities. These practices encourage a state of mindfulness, where the mind is fully present and engaged with the current moment. This heightened state of awareness reduces the tendency for the mind to wander and helps to cultivate a deeper sense of inner peace. Regular meditation can lead to significant changes in the brain's structure and function, including increased gray matter density in areas associated with learning, memory, and emotional regulation. The practice of mindfulness meditation, in particular, has been shown to improve attentional control by increasing the brain's capacity for sustained attention. It trains the mind to observe thoughts and sensations without becoming attached or distracted by them, thereby enhancing the ability to focus on the task at hand. Contemplative practices, which often involve reflective thinking on philosophical or spiritual topics, further deepen this focus by engaging the higher cognitive functions of the brain. Through these practices, individuals can develop a more profound connection to their inner selves and the world around them, fostering a holistic approach to focus and attention. These insights underscore the importance of understanding the neuroscience of attention and the impact of modern technology. By leveraging practices like meditation and mindfulness, individuals can enhance their focus, mitigate the effects of digital distraction, and cultivate a deeper, 
more intentional approach to life. Chapter 3. The Energetic Field of Concentration The concept of vibrational frequency and energy fields is central to understanding how focus and concentration can be enhanced. Nikola Tesla famously said, If you want to find the secrets of the universe, think in terms of energy, frequency, and vibration. This perspective suggests that everything in the universe, including human thoughts and emotions, vibrates at a particular frequency. These frequencies can be measured and influenced, affecting both our physical and mental states. When we are in a state of high vibrational frequency, we experience clarity, positivity, and a heightened ability to focus. Conversely, low vibrational states are often associated with confusion, negativity, and distraction. The personal energy field, often referred to as the aura, is a subtle field of energy that surrounds and permeates the human body. This field interacts with the environment and other energy fields, influencing our overall well-being and ability to concentrate. Practices such as energy healing, chakra balancing, and meditation are believed to help regulate and enhance our vibrational frequency promoting a balanced and harmonious state of being. By consciously raising our vibrational frequency, we can create a conducive environment for deep focus and mental clarity. Thoughts are not just ephemeral mental constructs, they are powerful energy forms that can shape our reality. The energy generated by focused thought can alter personal energy fields and attract corresponding experiences and outcomes. This concept is closely related to the law of attraction, which posits that like attracts like. Positive, focused thoughts can attract positive outcomes, while negative, scattered thoughts can lead to undesirable results. By mastering the art of focused thought, we can harness this energy to manifest our intentions and goals more effectively. The process of harnessing thought energy begins with intention setting a practice where one clearly defines their desires and visualizes the desired outcome. This focused intention aligns our thoughts and emotions with our goals, creating a powerful energetic field that draws in corresponding experiences. Regular practice of visualization and affirmation strengthens this energetic alignment, making it easier to maintain focus and achieve desired outcomes. The interplay between thought energy and personal energy fields underscores the importance of maintaining a positive and focused mindset in all aspects of life. The environment we inhabit plays a crucial role in influencing our focus and concentration. Just as personal energy fields can be influenced by thoughts and emotions, they can also be affected by the frequencies present in our surroundings. Environmental frequencies include the natural electromagnetic fields of the Earth, the artificial frequencies generated by electronic devices, and even the vibrational energies of other people. These external frequencies can either support or disrupt our mental and emotional balance. Creating a conducive environment for focus involves minimizing exposure to disruptive frequencies and maximizing exposure to supportive ones. This can be achieved by incorporating elements of nature, such as plants and natural light, into our living and working spaces. Additionally, practices like grounding, connecting with the Earth's natural energies, can help stabilize our personal energy fields. Understanding and managing environmental frequencies is a key aspect of maintaining deep focus and mental clarity, as it allows us to create a harmonious space that supports our intentions and goals. The energetic field of concentration encompasses the vibrational frequency of our thoughts, the influence of environmental frequencies, and the power of focused intention. By mastering these elements, we can enhance our ability to concentrate, align with our higher purposes, and manifest our deepest desires. This holistic approach to focus integrates spiritual principles with practical techniques, offering a comprehensive framework for achieving mental clarity and success. Chapter 4. The Spiritual Mind and Higher Consciousness The concept of the superconscious mind is a cornerstone in many spiritual traditions and philosophical teachings. Unlike the conscious and subconscious minds, 
which deal with everyday awareness and deep-seated beliefs, the superconscious mind is seen as the seat of higher wisdom, intuition, and divine inspiration. It is the aspect of consciousness that connects us to universal truths and higher realms of understanding. Accessing the superconscious mind can provide profound insights and creative inspiration, often described as aha, moments or flashes of genius. The distinction between the superconscious, subconscious, and conscious minds is crucial. While the conscious mind is concerned with logical reasoning and decision making, the subconscious governs our habits and beliefs. The superconscious, however, transcends these and taps into a more expansive awareness, offering a perspective beyond the ego. This state of consciousness is not easily accessible but can be reached through practices like meditation, prayer, and contemplation. It is in this state that individuals often experience a sense of oneness with the universe and gain access to knowledge that feels beyond their ordinary capacity. Meditation and contemplation are essential practices for cultivating a connection with the superconscious mind. These practices quiet the mind, allowing the practitioner to transcend ordinary thought processes and access deeper layers of consciousness. Meditation techniques vary widely, from focused attention on a mantra or breath to more open awareness practices. Regardless of the method, the goal is to enter a state of stillness and receptivity where the mind is free from distractions and open to higher guidance. Contemplation differs slightly from meditation in that it often involves reflective thinking on a particular spiritual or philosophical concept. This practice encourages a deep exploration of ideas, fostering a more intimate understanding of oneself and the universe. Through regular meditation and contemplation, individuals can develop greater intuitive abilities and a stronger connection to their inner wisdom. This enhanced intuition can guide decisions, inspire creative solutions, and provide a deeper sense of purpose and meaning in life. There are various techniques to enhance one's connection with the spiritual mind and access the superconscious state. Visualization is a powerful method, where one vividly imagines a desired outcome or state of being. This practice not only clarifies intentions but also aligns the individual's energy with that of the desired outcome, making it more likely to manifest. Another technique is the use of affirmations, positive, present tense statements that reinforce the reality one wishes to create. Repeating affirmations can help reprogram the subconscious mind and open the individual to the guidance of the superconscious. Another effective technique is mindfulness which involves maintaining a heightened awareness of the present moment without judgment. This practice helps to quiet the mind and reduce the influence of the ego, making it easier to access deeper states of consciousness. Additionally, engaging in creative activities, such as writing, painting, or music, can also facilitate a connection with the spiritual mind. These activities often require a state of flow, where the individual is fully immersed in the task, allowing for a natural alignment with higher consciousness. By integrating these practices into daily life, individuals can cultivate a deeper connection with their spiritual mind, accessing the wisdom and inspiration that resides in the superconscious. This connection not only enhances personal growth and self-awareness but also empowers individuals to navigate their lives with greater clarity and purpose. As we continue to explore the nature of focus and consciousness, we uncover the profound potential that lies within each of us to transcend ordinary existence and tap into a higher state of being. Chapter 5. Mastering the Subconscious Mind The subconscious mind is a powerful force that influences our behaviors, beliefs, and perceptions, often operating below the level of conscious awareness. It is responsible for the automatic responses and habits that shape our daily lives. Reprogramming the subconscious involves intentionally altering these deep-seated beliefs and patterns to align more closely with our conscious desires and goals. This process can be likened to updating the software of the mind, ensuring that it supports rather than hinders our aspirations. Bob Proctor, 
a renowned personal development speaker, emphasizes the importance of paradigms, deeply ingrained belief systems that govern our behavior. According to Proctor, to achieve significant changes in life, one must first change these paradigms. This can be accomplished through repeated affirmations, visualization, and positive self-talk, which gradually replace negative or limiting beliefs with empowering ones. Visualization, in particular, is a potent tool as it allows individuals to mentally rehearse desired outcomes, creating a vivid and emotional experience that imprints on the subconscious. Limiting beliefs are often invisible barriers that prevent individuals from achieving their full potential. These beliefs are usually formed in early childhood or through repeated negative experiences and can persist into adulthood, subtly influencing decisions and actions. Common limiting beliefs include feelings of unworthiness, fear of failure, and doubts about one's abilities. Overcoming these beliefs is crucial for achieving deep focus and realizing one's true potential. Identifying limiting beliefs is the first step toward overcoming them. This involves introspection and self-awareness, recognizing the patterns and thoughts that arise in challenging situations. Once identified, these beliefs can be challenged and reframed. For instance, a belief such as, I am not good enough, can be transformed into, I am constantly growing and improving. This shift in perspective not only changes the internal dialogue but also affects how one interacts with the world. Reprogramming the subconscious also involves emotional healing. Often, limiting beliefs are tied to unresolved emotional experiences. Techniques such as emotional freedom techniques, EFT, hypnosis, and guided meditation can be effective in addressing and releasing these emotional blocks. By clearing these emotional residues, individuals can free themselves from the past and create a new, empowering narrative that aligns with their goals and desires. Creating a new mental blueprint involves consistently nurturing positive thoughts and beliefs that support one's desired reality. This process requires dedication and persistence, as the subconscious mind does not change overnight. It is essential to maintain a daily practice of affirmations, visualization, and positive self-talk. The more vivid and emotionally charged these practices are, the more effectively they will reprogram the subconscious. In addition to internal work, the environment plays a significant role in shaping the subconscious. Surrounding oneself with positive influences, such as inspiring books, motivational content, and supportive people, can reinforce the new mental blueprint. It's also important to engage in activities that align with the desired changes, as action solidifies belief. For example, someone who wants to develop confidence may practice speaking in public, gradually reinforcing the belief in their abilities. Ultimately, mastering the subconscious mind is about taking control of the internal narrative and directing it toward positive outcomes. By consciously choosing thoughts, beliefs, and actions that align with one's highest aspirations, individuals can create a reality that reflects their true potential. This mastery not only enhances focus and productivity but also leads to a more fulfilling and empowered life. Through consistent practice and self-awareness, anyone can harness the power of the subconscious to achieve profound personal transformation. Chapter 6 Techniques for Deep Focus Establishing consistent daily practices is crucial for cultivating deep focus. These practices create a structure that helps anchor attention and direct energy toward meaningful tasks. Morning routines, in particular, set the tone for the day. They can include activities such as meditation, journaling, and exercise, which prime the mind and body for a productive day. Meditation calms the mind and enhances concentration, while journaling helps in setting clear intentions and organizing thoughts. Physical exercise boosts mood and energy levels, providing a solid foundation for sustained focus. Evening routines are equally important, serving as a time to wind down and reflect on the day's achievements and challenges. 
Practices like gratitude journaling and mindful reflection help consolidate the day's experiences and prepare the mind for rest. Decluttering one's physical and mental space at the end of the day can also aid in maintaining a clear focus. This might involve tidying up one's workspace, organizing tasks for the next day, and engaging in relaxation techniques such as deep breathing or light reading. The significance of environment and supporting focus cannot be overstated. A clutter-free, organized space reduces distractions and promotes a sense of calm and order. This principle extends beyond physical clutter. Digital clutter, such as unnecessary notifications and open tabs, should also be minimized. Creating a dedicated, distraction-free workspace signals to the brain that it is time to focus, enhancing the ability to concentrate on the tasks at hand. Advanced techniques for deep focus include methods like the Pomodoro technique, time blocking, and task prioritization. The Pomodoro technique involves working in short, intense bursts of focus, usually 25 minutes, followed by brief breaks. This method helps maintain high levels of concentration and prevents burnout by balancing work and rest. Time blocking involves scheduling specific times for different tasks throughout the day, ensuring that each task receives focused attention. This approach helps in managing time efficiently and reduces the likelihood of multitasking, which can dilute focus. Task prioritization is another critical component of maintaining deep focus. It involves identifying the most important and urgent tasks and addressing them first. Techniques such as the Eisenhower matrix can aid in this process, helping individuals distinguish between tasks that are urgent and important, and those that are less so. By focusing on high-priority tasks, individuals can achieve meaningful progress and avoid getting bogged down by less critical activities. Another technique is the practice of single-tasking, which stands in contrast to multitasking. Single-tasking involves dedicating full attention to one task at a time, thereby enhancing the quality of work and efficiency. This method allows for deeper engagement with the task, leading to greater creativity and problem-solving abilities. The key to successful single-tasking is setting clear boundaries, both physical and mental, to minimize interruptions and maintain focus. Maintaining an optimal mental state for deep focus involves managing stress, fostering a positive mindset, and cultivating resilience. Stress management techniques such as mindfulness meditation, deep breathing exercises, and progressive muscle relaxation can help reduce anxiety and enhance mental clarity. These practices not only calm the mind but also improve emotional regulation, allowing individuals to remain focused even in challenging situations. Fostering a positive mindset is another essential aspect of achieving deep focus. Positive affirmations, visualization, and practicing gratitude can shift the mental landscape from one of doubt and negativity to one of confidence and possibility. A positive mindset enhances motivation and perseverance, making it easier to stay committed to long-term goals. Additionally, cultivating resilience, the ability to bounce back from setbacks, is crucial for maintaining focus over time. Resilience can be developed through self-compassion, learning from failures, and viewing challenges as opportunities for growth. Achieving and maintaining deep focus requires a combination of structured routines, advanced focus techniques, and a supportive mental and physical environment. By integrating these elements into daily life, individuals can enhance their ability to concentrate, achieve their goals, and experience a greater sense of fulfillment and purpose. The practices outlined in this chapter offer a comprehensive approach to mastering the art of deep focus, providing a solid foundation for personal and professional success. Chapter 7. The Art of Mindfulness and Presence. Mindfulness the practice of staying fully engaged in the present moment is a powerful tool for enhancing focus and clarity. It involves observing one's thoughts, emotions, and sensations without judgment, creating a space between the stimuli and the response. 
This practice helps to break the cycle of automatic reactions and brings conscious awareness to every action. By cultivating present moment awareness, individuals can better manage distractions, reduce stress, and improve their overall quality of life. Mindfulness can be practiced in various forms, including mindful breathing, mindful eating, and mindful walking. Mindful breathing involves focusing on the breath as it flows in and out, which can anchor the mind and provide a sense of calm. This practice is particularly useful during stressful situations, as it helps to ground the practitioner and maintain composure. Mindful eating, on the other hand, involves paying full attention to the experience of eating, savoring each bite, and noticing the flavors, textures, and sensations. This practice not only enhances the enjoyment of food but also promotes healthier eating habits. Mindful walking is another effective practice, where one pays close attention to the sensations of movement, the contact of the feet with the ground, and the rhythm of the breath. This form of mindfulness can be especially beneficial for those who find sitting meditation challenging. By incorporating these practices into daily life, individuals can develop a heightened sense of presence and awareness, making it easier to focus on the tasks at hand and respond to life's challenges with clarity and intention. Mindful breathing is a foundational practice in mindfulness, serving as a simple yet profound way to center the mind. By focusing on the breath, individuals can detach from the constant stream of thoughts and bring their attention back to the present. This practice can be as simple as taking a few deep breaths, inhaling deeply through the nose, and exhaling slowly through the mouth. As the breath becomes the focal point, it helps to calm the mind and reduce the physiological symptoms of stress, such as increased heart rate and muscle tension. Body awareness complements mindful breathing by encouraging individuals to pay attention to physical sensations. This practice can involve a body scan, where one mentally scans the body from head to toe, noticing areas of tension, relaxation, warmth, or coolness. By bringing awareness to these sensations, individuals can release physical tension and cultivate a deeper connection between the mind and body. This heightened awareness not only improves focus but also promotes better physical health by encouraging relaxation and reducing stress-related symptoms. The combination of mindful breathing and body awareness can be particularly effective in enhancing focus during work or study. Before starting a task, taking a few moments to practice these techniques can help set a calm and focused tone. During the task, Periodically checking in with the breath and body can help maintain concentration and prevent mental fatigue. These practices are also valuable tools for managing emotions, as they provide a way to pause and respond thoughtfully rather than react impulsively. Mindfulness is not limited to formal meditation practices. It can be integrated into everyday activities to enhance focus and presence. This approach transforms routine tasks into opportunities for mindfulness, making it easier to maintain a state of awareness throughout the day. For example, while washing dishes, one can focus on the sensation of the water, the texture of the dishes, and the sounds of the clinking utensils. By fully engaging with the task, the mind stays present, preventing it from wandering to past regrets or future worries. Another practical application of mindfulness is during conversations. By practicing mindful listening, individuals can give their full attention to the speaker, noticing not only the words but also the tone, body language, and emotions conveyed. This deep listening fosters better communication, empathy, and understanding, making interactions more meaningful and productive. It also helps to avoid distractions, such as checking a phone or thinking about what to say next, which can detract from the quality of the conversation. In the workplace, mindfulness can be applied to enhance productivity and reduce stress. For instance, setting aside specific times to check emails or social media can prevent these activities from interrupting more focused work. Taking short mindfulness breaks, such as a few minutes of deep breathing or a brief walk, 
can refresh the mind and improve concentration. By incorporating mindfulness into daily routines, individuals can cultivate a more balanced and centered approach to life, enhancing their ability to focus and achieve their goals. Chapter 8. Overcoming Mental and Emotional Distractions Mental and emotional distractions can significantly impact focus and productivity. Identifying these distractions is the first step toward managing them effectively. Internal distractions often stem from our own thoughts and emotions, such as worries, anxieties, and ruminations. These can arise from unresolved personal issues, fear of failure, or even excitement about future possibilities. For example, Thoughts about an upcoming event or concern over a past mistake can pull attention away from the present task. External distractions, on the other hand, are stimuli from the environment that divert attention. These include noise, interruptions from people, notifications from electronic devices, and visual clutter. The modern digital world, with its constant stream of information and notifications, is particularly challenging for maintaining focus. Recognizing these distractions involves becoming aware of what frequently pulls attention away and understanding the triggers behind these disruptions. This awareness is crucial for developing strategies to minimize or eliminate distractions, allowing for sustained focus on important tasks. Once distractions are identified, the next step is to neutralize them. For internal distractions, Mindfulness and cognitive behavioral techniques can be highly effective. Mindfulness helps individuals become aware of their thoughts and emotions without getting caught up in them. By observing these distractions as they arise, one can acknowledge their presence and gently bring attention back to the task at hand. This practice reduces the power of internal distractions and helps maintain focus. Cognitive behavioral techniques involve challenging and reframing negative or distracting thoughts. For instance, if a person is worried about an upcoming deadline, they can reframe the thought from, I'm not going to finish on time, to, I will prioritize my tasks and manage my time effectively. This shift in perspective reduces anxiety and promotes a proactive approach. Additionally, setting specific times for worrying, known as, worry time, can help contain anxiety and prevent it from spilling over into productive periods. For external distractions, creating a conducive environment is key. This might involve setting up a dedicated workspace, using noise-canceling headphones, or implementing strict boundaries regarding interruptions. Digital distractions can be managed by turning off notifications, using website blockers, and scheduling specific times for checking emails and social media. Physical clutter can also be a distraction. Thus, maintaining an organized and tidy workspace can help minimize visual distractions and promote mental clarity. Developing mental resilience is essential for maintaining focus in the face of distractions. Resilience is the ability to bounce back from setbacks and adapt to challenging situations. This trait can be cultivated through several practices, including setting realistic goals, maintaining a positive outlook, and developing coping strategies for stress. A key aspect of resilience is the ability to accept that distractions and challenges are a natural part of life and that overcoming them is an opportunity for growth. One effective strategy for building resilience is the practice of self-compassion. This involves treating oneself with kindness and understanding during difficult times, rather than with harsh criticism. Self-compassion helps in managing stress and reduces the negative impact of setbacks on focus and motivation. Another strategy is the use of affirmations, positive statements that reinforce one's strengths and abilities. Affirmations can boost confidence and remind individuals of their capacity to handle challenges. Additionally, physical health plays a crucial role in mental resilience. Regular exercise, adequate sleep, and a healthy diet contribute to better stress management and cognitive function. Exercise, in particular, has been shown to reduce symptoms of anxiety and depression, improve mood, and enhance cognitive abilities. 
By prioritizing physical well-being, individuals can better manage stress and maintain focus, even in the face of distractions. Overcoming mental and emotional distractions involves a combination of awareness, strategic management, and resilience-building practices. By identifying distractions, implementing techniques to neutralize them, and developing mental resilience, individuals can cultivate a strong focus and achieve their goals more effectively. This holistic approach not only enhances productivity but also promotes overall well-being and personal growth. Chapter 9. The Philosophy of Intentional Living Living with intention involves aligning daily actions with a higher purpose, a concept deeply rooted in both spiritual and philosophical traditions. This alignment ensures that one's life path is not merely a series of random events but a deliberate journey toward meaningful goals. The importance of understanding one's higher purpose cannot be overstated, as it provides a sense of direction and fulfillment. When individuals are clear about their purpose, their actions become more focused and deliberate, reducing the likelihood of distractions and wasted effort. Neville Goddard emphasized the concept of living, from the end, which means embodying the state of having already achieved one's goals. This principle encourages individuals to act as if they have already attained their desired outcomes, thus aligning their thoughts, emotions, and behaviors with their aspirations. This approach not only fosters a positive mindset but also aligns one's energy with the reality they wish to create. By consistently visualizing and feeling the fulfillment of their goals, individuals can bring those goals into reality through the power of intentional living. Living with intention also involves a continuous process of self-reflection and adjustment. As individuals grow and evolve, their goals and purposes may shift. Regular introspection helps in reassessing and realigning one's actions with their evolving purpose. This dynamic process ensures that one's life remains aligned with their highest values and aspirations, leading to a more authentic and fulfilling existence. The practice of journaling, meditation, and consultation with mentors or spiritual guides can aid in this ongoing journey of self-discovery and alignment. Setting clear, purposeful intentions is foundational to maintaining focus. Intentions act as a guiding compass, helping individuals prioritize tasks and make decisions that are in line with their higher goals. Without clear intentions, it is easy to become distracted by immediate, superficial desires or external pressures. Intentional living requires a disciplined approach to discerning what is truly important and what is merely a distraction. Intentions differ from goals in that they are broader and more encompassing. While goals are specific achievements one aims to accomplish, intentions reflect the overall direction and quality of one's life. For example, an intention might be to live a life of compassion and service, while a specific goal could be to volunteer a certain number of hours per week. By keeping intentions in mind, individuals can navigate challenges and setbacks with greater resilience, as they are anchored in a deeper sense of purpose. The process of setting and reaffirming intentions can be ritualized to enhance its effectiveness. This might include daily affirmations, visualization exercises, or creating a vision board that represents one's intentions. These practices help reinforce the desired mindset and keep the individual focused on their higher purpose. By regularly revisiting and refining intentions, individuals can maintain a clear and focused direction in life, even amidst the inevitable distractions and challenges that arise. Neville Goddard's teachings on the law of assumption and living, from the end, offer a powerful framework for intentional living. This concept involves assuming the feeling of the wish fulfilled, which means embodying the emotional and mental state of having already achieved one's desires. By doing so, individuals align their inner world with the reality they wish to create, making it more likely to manifest in the physical world. Goddard argued that imagination is the creative force behind all reality. Therefore, by vividly imagining and feeling the end result, individuals can influence the subconscious mind, 
which in turn shapes their behaviors and external circumstances. This practice requires a deep conviction in the power of one's imagination and a willingness to let go of limiting beliefs that contradict the desired outcome. Living, from the end, also involves a certain level of detachment. While it is important to visualize and feel the fulfillment of one's desires, it is equally crucial to trust the process and not become overly attached to specific outcomes or timelines. This detachment allows for flexibility and openness to different paths that may lead to the same destination. It fosters a state of peace and confidence, knowing that the desired outcome is already secured in the mental and spiritual realm. The philosophy of intentional living is about aligning one's actions with a higher purpose, setting clear intentions, and embodying the state of the desired outcome. It requires a disciplined approach to self-reflection, setting priorities, and maintaining focus amidst distractions. By living intentionally, individuals can create a life that is not only successful by conventional standards but also deeply fulfilling and aligned with their true selves. Chapter 10. The Law of Assumption and Manifestation The Law of Assumption, as taught by Neville Goddard, posits that what we assume to be true in our imagination manifests in our reality. This principle is based on the idea that consciousness is the only reality and that our perceptions shape our experiences. By assuming the feeling of the wish fulfilled, we align our inner state with our desired outcomes, making them more likely to materialize. This approach requires more than mere positive thinking. It demands a deep, emotional conviction in the reality of the desired state. When we consistently embody the emotions and beliefs associated with our goals, we create a mental environment that naturally attracts corresponding experiences. To effectively use the law of assumption, it is essential to practice living in the end. This means acting and feeling as if the desired outcome has already been achieved. For instance, if one desires financial abundance, they should cultivate the feelings of security, freedom, and gratitude that would accompany such a state. This practice shifts the focus from lack and want to abundance and fulfillment, thereby transforming one's vibration and aligning it with the desired reality. The key is to maintain this assumption consistently, even in the face of contrary evidence, trusting that the physical world will eventually reflect the inner reality. This method of manifestation is not about forcing or coercing reality but rather about aligning one's inner world with the desired state. It requires patience, faith, and a willingness to let go of old, limiting beliefs that contradict the new assumption. The more vividly and consistently one can imagine and feel the desired outcome, the more powerfully the subconscious mind will work to bring it into existence. This process emphasizes the importance of mental discipline and the deliberate cultivation of a positive, empowering inner dialogue. Creating a compelling vision for the future is an essential aspect of intentional living and manifestation. A clear and inspiring vision serves as a roadmap guiding actions and decisions towards the realization of one's highest potential. This vision should encompass not only material goals but also personal growth, relationships, health, and spiritual fulfillment. By encompassing all aspects of life, the vision becomes a holistic representation of one's deepest desires and values. The process of crafting a vision begins with introspection and self-awareness. It involves identifying core values, passions, and long-term aspirations. One effective technique is to write a detailed description of one's ideal life, including specific details about daily routines, career achievements, relationships, and personal accomplishments. This written vision serves as a tangible reminder of what one is working towards and helps to clarify the steps needed to get there. Visualization is a powerful tool in creating and sustaining a vision. By regularly visualizing the desired future in vivid detail, individuals can reinforce their commitment to their goals and keep their motivation high. Visualization not only enhances focus but also engages the subconscious mind, 
which begins to work towards aligning external circumstances with the envisioned reality. This practice is most effective when combined with the emotional experience of already having achieved the desired outcomes, as it deepens the belief in their inevitability. Practical exercises can help solidify the concepts of assumption and manifestation, making them more tangible and actionable. One such exercise is the mirror technique, where individuals stand in front of a mirror and speak affirmations as if they have already achieved their goals. This practice helps to integrate the desired state into one's self-image, reinforcing the assumption of success. Another effective exercise is scripting, which involves writing a detailed narrative of one's life as if all goals have been achieved. This script should be written in the present tense, focusing on the emotions, experiences, and changes that have occurred. By repeatedly reading and internalizing this script, individuals can strengthen their belief in the reality of their desires, making it easier for the subconscious mind to bring them to fruition. Finally, the practice of gratitude can significantly enhance the process of manifestation. By focusing on what one is grateful for, both in the present and in the envisioned future, individuals can cultivate a mindset of abundance and appreciation. This positive emotional state amplifies the energy of the desired outcome, attracting more of the same into one's life. Gratitude also helps to shift focus away from lack and towards the positive aspects of one's current reality, making the process of manifestation more joyful and fulfilling. In summary, the law of assumption and the practice of manifestation involve a deep alignment of one's inner world with desired outcomes. By assuming the reality of their goals, creating a clear vision for the future, and engaging in practical exercises, individuals can harness the power of their imagination to shape their reality. This approach requires consistent effort, faith, and a willingness to embrace change, but it offers the promise of profound transformation and the realization of one's deepest desires. Chapter 11. The Quantum Perspective and Focus. Quantum mechanics offers profound insights into the nature of reality and the power of focus. One of the most intriguing aspects of quantum theory is the observer effect, which posits that the act of observation can influence the behavior of particles. This phenomenon suggests that the mere act of focusing attention can alter the outcome of an event. In the realm of personal development and manifestation, this principle can be metaphorically applied to how focused intention shapes reality. By consciously directing attention and energy towards specific goals, individuals can influence their outcomes, similar to how an observer in quantum physics affects a particle's behavior. This concept aligns with the teachings of Neville Goddard and other metaphysical thinkers, who assert that consciousness is the primary reality. In this view, the physical world is a reflection of inner states of being, shaped by thoughts, beliefs, and expectations. The observer effect underscores the importance of maintaining a clear and focused mind, as scattered thoughts and intentions can lead to chaotic and unintended results. By cultivating a disciplined focus, individuals can harness the power of their consciousness to manifest desired outcomes, much like a scientist controls an experiment by focusing on specific variables. The interplay between consciousness and reality is a central theme in both spiritual traditions and modern quantum theories. From a philosophical perspective, consciousness is not just a passive observer but an active participant in the creation of reality. This idea suggests that the mind can influence physical events, a concept that has been explored in various cultural and spiritual contexts. For instance, in Eastern philosophies, the mind is often seen as the creator of the world, where changing one's mental state can lead to a transformation in external circumstances. In quantum physics, the idea that reality is influenced by the observer's consciousness challenges traditional notions of objective reality. This perspective implies that reality is not fixed but is instead a dynamic interplay between the observer's mind and the external world. This aligns with the law of attraction, which suggests that like attracts like, 
meaning that the energy and frequency one emits can attract corresponding experiences and circumstances. This understanding encourages individuals to cultivate positive thoughts and emotions, as these can shape the nature of their experiences and interactions with the world. Practically, this means that individuals have a significant degree of control over their lives. By consciously choosing their thoughts, emotions, and actions, they can influence the reality they experience. This empowers people to take responsibility for their lives, recognizing that they are co-creators of their reality. It also highlights the importance of self-awareness and mindfulness, as being aware of one's inner state is crucial for consciously shaping one's life experiences. The philosophical implications of quantum theories extend beyond the realm of science and into everyday life, particularly in understanding the nature of focus and intention. The idea that reality is not absolute but shaped by observation and intention can be liberating and empowering. It suggests that limitations are not inherent in reality but are often self-imposed through limiting beliefs and narrow perceptions. By expanding one's consciousness and aligning with higher frequencies of thought, individuals can transcend these limitations and open themselves to new possibilities. This perspective encourages a shift from a deterministic view of life, where events happen independently of one's influence, to a more interactive and participatory model. In this model, individuals are seen as active participants in the unfolding of their lives, with the ability to influence outcomes through their focus and intention. This shift in understanding can lead to greater personal empowerment, as individuals realize that they are not merely passive recipients of life's circumstances but active creators of their destiny. In practical terms, this means that maintaining a focused and clear intention is essential for achieving desired outcomes. Distractions and conflicting thoughts can dilute one's focus and lead to mixed results. Therefore, practices such as meditation, visualization, and affirmations are valuable tools for strengthening one's focus and aligning with desired outcomes. By consistently aligning thoughts and emotions with one's goals, individuals can effectively navigate the quantum field of possibilities and manifest the reality they desire. The quantum perspective provides a rich and nuanced understanding of the interplay between consciousness and reality. It underscores the power of focus and intention in shaping one's experiences and highlights the importance of cultivating a disciplined and positive mental state. This understanding empowers individuals to take an active role in creating their lives, using the principles of quantum mechanics and consciousness to achieve greater focus, clarity, and fulfillment. Chapter 12. Practical Applications and Real-World Examples The lives of highly successful individuals often provide valuable lessons on the power of deep focus and intentional living. For example, Nikola Tesla, renowned for his pioneering work in electricity and electromagnetism, exemplified extraordinary focus. Tesla was known for his ability to visualize complex inventions entirely in his mind before committing them to paper or building prototypes. This mental clarity and precision allowed him to develop groundbreaking technologies that continue to influence the world today. Tesla's ability to immerse himself fully in his work, often disregarding external distractions and societal norms, highlights the profound impact of sustained focus on innovation and progress. Similarly, the work of authors like Neville Goddard emphasizes the importance of focused imagination in creating one's desired reality. Goddard's teachings on the law of assumptions suggest that living with a deep belief in the reality of one's goals can bring them into existence. His life and teachings are filled with examples of individuals who, through dedicated practice of focused intention, transformed their circumstances and achieved extraordinary success. These stories illustrate the potential of aligning one's inner beliefs with external actions to manifest desired outcomes. Another notable figure is Steve Jobs, co-founder of Apple Inc., who was known for his intense focus and perfectionism. 
Jobs's vision for Apple products was so clear and compelling that it not only revolutionized the technology industry but also redefined consumer expectations worldwide. His ability to concentrate on the finer details of design and user experience, coupled with his relentless pursuit of innovation, serves as a testament to the power of focus in achieving exceptional results. These examples underscore the importance of maintaining a clear vision and the discipline to focus on it, even in the face of challenges and distractions. The habits and routines of these focused individuals reveal key principles that can be applied to cultivate deep focus. One commonality is the establishment of a structured daily routine that prioritizes work and minimizes distractions. For instance, Many successful people start their day with activities that center their mind and body, such as meditation, exercise, or reading. These morning rituals set a positive tone for the day and enhance mental clarity. The practice of time blocking, where specific periods are dedicated to particular tasks, also helps in maintaining focus and productivity. Another critical practice is the deliberate setting of priorities. Successful individuals often distinguish between high-value tasks that directly contribute to their long-term goals and less critical activities. This prioritization ensures that their energy and attention are directed towards what matters most, reducing the likelihood of being sidetracked by trivial matters. Additionally, they often employ techniques such as the Pomodoro technique or deep work sessions, where they work intensively on a task for a set period followed by a short break. These techniques help maintain high levels of concentration and prevent burnout. Mental practices such as visualization and affirmations are also common among highly focused individuals. These practices involve mentally rehearsing success scenarios and reinforcing positive beliefs about one's abilities. Visualization helps in creating a mental blueprint of desired outcomes making them feel more tangible and achievable. Affirmations, on the other hand, help in cultivating a positive mindset and reinforcing confidence. By regularly engaging in these mental practices, individuals can strengthen their focus and align their subconscious mind with their conscious goals. The principles of deep focus and intentional living are not limited to specific professions they can be applied across various fields to enhance performance and satisfaction. In creative fields like writing, art, or music, maintaining a high level of focus is crucial for tapping into one's creative potential. Artists and writers often find that setting aside dedicated time for uninterrupted work, away from distractions, allows for a deeper exploration of ideas and themes. Similarly, in scientific research and engineering, Focused work is essential for solving complex problems and innovating new solutions. In business and entrepreneurship, focus is vital for strategic planning and execution. Entrepreneurs who can concentrate on their vision and goals are more likely to navigate the uncertainties of starting and growing a business. Focus also plays a critical role in leadership, as leaders must prioritize decisions and actions that align with the organization's mission and long-term objectives. In fields like sports, focus is equally important, as athletes must maintain mental clarity and concentration to perform at their best. In everyday life, the principles of deep focus can enhance personal well-being and relationships. By being fully present in interactions, individuals can deepen their connections with others and foster more meaningful relationships. In personal development, focusing on self-improvement goals, such as learning new skills or adopting healthier habits, leads to more consistent and significant progress. Overall, the application of focus techniques across various aspects of life can lead to greater achievement, satisfaction, and fulfillment. The practical application of focus principles, as demonstrated by successful individuals and across various fields, highlights the transformative power of deep focus. By adopting effective habits, setting clear priorities, and engaging in mental practices, individuals can enhance their ability to concentrate and achieve their goals. Whether in professional endeavors or personal growth, 
the ability to focus deeply is a key factor in unlocking one's full potential and living a purposeful life. Chapter 13. Sustaining Focus in a Distracted World In a world filled with constant distractions and rapid technological advancements, sustaining deep focus requires deliberate strategies and consistent effort. One of the most effective long-term strategies is the development of disciplined habits and routines. This involves creating a daily schedule that prioritizes focused work and minimizes interruptions. For instance, setting specific times for deep work, where distractions like social media and non-essential communications are avoided, can significantly enhance productivity. Such routines help in building a rhythm that supports sustained focus, making it easier to transition into a concentrated state. Another crucial strategy is the cultivation of a mindset that values focus and deep work. This involves recognizing the importance of focus as a skill that can be developed and honed over time. Individuals can benefit from setting clear, long-term goals that align with their values and aspirations, as these provide a strong motivation to maintain focus. Additionally, Practicing mindfulness and meditation can help in training the mind to stay present and reduce susceptibility to distractions. These practices not only improve attention but also enhance emotional regulation, allowing individuals to maintain focus even in challenging situations. It is also beneficial to periodically review and adjust one's strategies for maintaining focus. This might involve reassessing the effectiveness of current routines experimenting with new techniques, or seeking feedback from mentors and peers. By staying flexible and open to change, individuals can continuously optimize their approach to focus, ensuring it remains effective in different contexts and stages of life. Regular self-reflection and assessment can also help in identifying areas for improvement and celebrating progress, thus sustaining motivation and commitment. The journey towards mastering deep focus is an ongoing process that requires the cultivation of lifelong habits. One such habit is the practice of continuous learning and self-improvement. This involves staying curious and open to new ideas, skills, and perspectives. By regularly engaging in learning activities, individuals can keep their minds sharp and adaptable which is essential for maintaining focus in a constantly changing world. Whether through formal education, reading, or experiential learning, the commitment to growth fosters a mindset that values focus and intentionality. Another important habit is the maintenance of physical and mental well-being. A healthy body and mind are foundational to sustaining focus over the long term. This includes regular exercise, a balanced diet, adequate sleep, and stress management techniques. Physical health directly influences cognitive functions such as attention, memory, and problem-solving abilities, making it a critical component of deep focus. Similarly, mental well-being, nurtured through practices like mindfulness, meditation, and self-care, supports emotional balance and resilience, enabling individuals to handle distractions and setbacks more effectively. Building a supportive environment is also key to sustaining focus. This involves creating a physical space conducive to deep work, free from unnecessary distractions and clutter. It also includes surrounding oneself with a community that values and supports focused effort. This community can be comprised of mentors, peers, or a network of like-minded individuals who provide encouragement, accountability, and constructive feedback. By fostering an environment that nurtures focus, individuals can reinforce their commitment to deep work and continuous improvement. As society continues to evolve, the challenges to maintaining focus are likely to increase, particularly with the proliferation of digital technologies and information overload. However, this also presents opportunities for individuals and organizations to develop new tools and strategies to enhance focus. For instance, the growing field of digital well-being offers various applications and technologies designed to help individuals manage screen time, reduce distractions, and prioritize meaningful interactions. 
These tools can be integrated into daily routines to support deeper focus and healthier technology use. Moreover, there is a growing recognition of the importance of focus in education, work, and personal development. As the demands for cognitive and emotional resilience increase, educational systems and workplaces are beginning to emphasize skills like mindfulness, emotional intelligence, and metacognition. These skills are essential for navigating the complexities of modern life and maintaining focus amidst distractions. As awareness of these needs grows, we may see a greater emphasis on teaching and cultivating focus as a fundamental life skill. Sustaining deep focus in a distracted world requires a combination of disciplined habits, a supportive environment, and a commitment to continuous improvement. By embracing these strategies and staying adaptable, individuals can cultivate the ability to focus deeply and achieve their goals despite the challenges of modern life. The future of focus lies in our ability to harness technology wisely, foster environments that support deep work, and cultivate a cultural appreciation for the power of sustained attention and intentional living. Integration and Application As we conclude this exploration of deep focus and its transformative power, it's essential to integrate the key insights and practices into daily life. The journey towards mastering focus is not a destination but an ongoing process of growth and self-discovery. At the heart of this journey lies the understanding that focus is not merely a mental state but a holistic alignment of mind, body, and spirit. By cultivating a deep awareness of our thoughts, emotions, and intentions, we can harness the full potential of our inner resources and align them with our highest aspirations. The teachings and practices discussed throughout this book, drawn from the insights of figures like Nikola Tesla, Neville Goddard, Bob Proctor, and Joe Dispenza, offer a comprehensive framework for developing and sustaining deep focus. These insights emphasize the interconnectedness of consciousness and reality, the power of thought and intention, and the critical role of mindfulness and presence. By embracing these principles, individuals can transcend the limitations of their current circumstances and create a life that reflects their true potential. One of the most profound lessons from this exploration is the power of intentional living. By setting clear, purposeful intentions and aligning daily actions with these intentions, we can create a coherent and meaningful life path. This involves not only focusing on external goals but also cultivating an inner state of harmony and balance. Practices such as meditation, Visualization and affirmations are valuable tools for maintaining this inner alignment and reinforcing our commitment to our highest goals. As we move forward, it is crucial to remember that the process of developing deep focus and intentional living is iterative. It requires patience, perseverance, and a willingness to learn from both successes and challenges. The journey is as important as the destination and each step offers valuable lessons and opportunities for growth. By staying committed to the practices and principles outlined in this book, individuals can cultivate a resilient and focused mind, capable of navigating the complexities of modern life with clarity and purpose. Finally, the journey of deep focus and intentional living is not one that needs to be taken alone. Building a community of like-minded individuals who share similar values and goals can provide invaluable support and encouragement. Whether through formal groups, online communities, or personal networks, connecting with others who are also committed to personal growth and self-mastery can enrich the journey and provide additional insights and inspiration. In closing, the promise of deep focus and intentional living lies in the ability to create a life that is not only productive and successful but also fulfilling and aligned with one's deepest values and aspirations. By embracing the teachings of this book and integrating them into daily practice, individuals can unlock their full potential and live a life of purpose, clarity, and joy. As we continue on this path, let us remain open to the infinite possibilities that lie within us and around us, and let our journey be guided by the light of our highest selves.